All right, now we're ready to basically start creating some visuals in Power BI. And before we do that, I want to show you all how you can set up your pages so that you can always refer back to your tutorial and just see some of the things that you were able to do in your introduction in your introduction to Power BI and refer back to your tutorial forever using a PB, using your PBX file. So first thing first, we're going to come down here where it says page one. And we're going to double click that. And we're going to change this to say stacked bar chart. All right, so now that it says stack bar chart, we know that this page is our stack bar chart page. We're going to next go to insert and we're going to insert a shape. We're going to take the shape up here, which is this rectangle, and we're just going to pull it across up the, the top of this. And now that we've created this shape, we're going to go right here where it says format and we're going to format this visual. So in here we have styles and sizes or sizes and <laughs> size and style and we can have padding, background, visual border, shadow, so on and so forth. Let's just turn on the shadow so it can look cool. <laughs> and then we're going to just come down here where it says shape style and we're going to go to fill and let's just change this color to your own desired aesthetic. I'm just going to change it here to this color and then I'm going to get rid of the border once you have done that we're going to turn on our text so toggle that on and here we can just call this again stack bar chart okay now here you can see where you can increase the font size so if I wanted to increase that font size I can do that I can also make it bold and I can also change the font color so here is where it's going to basically say stacked bar chart right up here okay so I'll give you the ability to customize this to your own liking by just letting you choose your own desired aesthetics alright so anytime you want to go back into formatting any visual or any shape or anything that you add all you have to do is just simply click on it and it'll give you the ability to do that now if you want to turn your border on you can also do that and you can change the color of your border if you want to do that as well as the width and now your stack bar chart will be at the top and as we step through this we'll just duplicate this okay so this is the way we create how our pages will look when we land on them